is uh, charging hourly versus a flat rate. Well, you learned this lesson, didn't you? It's something else he taught me. So, several of you, my you, business... Thumbs up or thumbs down? Uh, we have to be efficient. Charge hourly. Yes. Like, I think flat rates can be okay. So, for example, if you say work... You know, you get 40 hours for a flat rate of this amount of money. People don't people don't understand what your 40 hours looks like, though. They can eat up 40 hours of planning in like a... Two like, days. Yeah, because it's 12 to 16 hour days. And then suddenly they have buyer's remorse because they don't know what your hours look like. The same thing with cake, all right? They don't... They see what's on TV and they see that TV... You can do this amazing cake in an, in 42 minutes on an episode of a tell, which literally takes a week to produce one five-tiered wedding cake if you're doing it well and doing it correctly. So it, we we can't do by the hour. We can't. I mean, by the flat, flat rate, rate. Because people don't know what flat rate 40 hours of work looks like. But it also goes into creativity. And so tracking your time, and it's something that many business coaches as well as Jay taught me that... Even if you do it for a year and you don't charge that way, it is just good for yourself to know how much your time is worth. And then I promise you, the following year, when you take 30, 50, 100 events and weddings, you will reevaluate how you're spending your time and how your client's paying you.